Video from an ATM in Tamarack shows a man being robbed at gunpoint. Police are searching for the two suspects. On May 3rd, the 57-year-old man was using the Bank of America ATM on Rock Island Road when two men demanded he give them everything he had. One of those men pointed a gun at the man and stood behind him as he completed his transaction. The camera caught a clear shot of his face. They took the victim's cash, cell phone, and wallet. Anyone with information is asked to call Broward County, uh, Broward Sheriff's Department. Matt Uris, CBS Miami. Good guys, bad guys, right and wrong, guilty or innocent. <laughs> it's never that simple. You already know that now, don't you? The Golf premieres Monday, August 26, on 3. Chaos in the streets. Teens accused of joyriding in a stolen car, then taking off on foot. A day later, chaos in court. The young defendants cursing and carrying on with little regard for the law. A Broward County courtroom turned into a circus Tuesday. What was supposed to be a serious situation was met with laughing, smiling, kicking, cursing, and outbursts. Just one day after police say 14 suspects led them on a multi city chase. Get that off of me, what the, the end result more individuals being taken into custody. I don't get the camera though. Hush your mouth. I said it. At the hearing for 15-year-old Maurice Thomas, the suspected driver, and 15-year-old Thomas Butler, seen here smiling for our cameras, the pair seemed to show up to show out in front of a judge. They're already accused of stealing cars and running from police. Also, the four suspects are wanted for crimes in Broward, Palm Beach, and Martin counties. <laughs> It started Monday evening when police say four teens stole this blue car at Lighthouse Point, then ditched it in Lauderdale Lakes, took off across this field, and stole another car, police say. The suspects were caught, but the antics continued Tuesday in the courtroom when their friends were belligerent, then refused to leave. In the end, several more were arrested.